What up and good morning. It's your girl, Manna Meeks, and I'm back with more Loki. And if you're enjoying this reaction series or anything else you got on my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I'm here. You're here. Let's be here together. Down below in the description box, I have a link to my Patreon. It's patreon.com forward slash Manna Meeks. And over there, I have filming versions of my reaction as well as clear YouTube versions. And I also have select early access series. And also down below, I have a link to my merch shop. Right now, I'm, I'm, I'm repping the uh, Marvel Moist uh, ha shirt, sweatshirt, hoodie situation because it's cold down here. Even though it's currently 82 degrees outside, it's cold. AF. It's cold AF in here. Get okay, cool. But all of that is down below in the description box. If you want to support me monetarily, those are your two options. But you don't have to support me monetarily. You want to know why? Because you can support me freeitarily. How do you do that? Subscribe because it's free. It's right. It's right. Like right here. It's right. 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 Right up in here. Tickle. 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 Right here. So, um, if you want to support me for free, subscribe. It's pretty cool. I do appreciate it. Um, so last time on Loki, we had a, like a, I don't want to call it a wacky racers because it wasn't really a race. <laughs> um, Loki and Sylvie, we found out her name was Sylvie, are trapped on Lamentus One. I'm going to use trapped on Lamentus One during uh, their Nexus, not Nexus events, I think it was an apocalypse, during their apocalypse. And they were just trying to figure out um, how to get off the planet because Loki supposedly broke the uncharged uh, time thingamabobbler. It was just like a weird episode to me. It, it, we didn't get any information on Sylvie. Not really. We didn't get any new information to the situation at hand. I think the only bit of information we got was that the time variance uh, authority is made up of people who are variants themselves. So it looks like um, the reset would have been to wipe their minds and have them working for uh, the time variance authority. That's what I'm thinking. Um, so the fact that they had a life before and it was erased is, I think is really important. But other than that, I, I thought it was just like a bunch of hoopla. Like, listen, you have Loki, who is a god and a frost giant. You trying to tell me he couldn't figure out a way to magic themselves out of there? Or magic themselves to the thing? Or they're like, oh yeah, let's go to this ship because, you know, she said earlier that the ship never made it off the planet. But oh yeah, let's go to the ship, let's go to the ship, let's try to go to the ship. You could have poof magic, you could have, you know, poof pal surprise and been up in the ship. I just thought that it was weird that they were walking around like they didn't have any ability to do anything. Like I, I just, I couldn't figure out what the episode was for. It was very, it was very, uh, uh, lost plot wise. I wasn't, mm, mm, it wasn't my favorite. Um, but I am excited to see where we're going from here. We got three episodes left and I just want more information. So on that note. Uh, let's go ahead and jump into Loki season one, episode four, the Nexus event. It's Asgard? There's a variant. Oh, she was a kid. Girl, I'd be, I'd be walking like that too. Y'all just let her walk out? Okay. My face is like strenuous right now. Oh, this creepy. Not it creepy. Not it creepy. Under the best of circumstances, it's jarring to stand before the timekeepers. And this is not the best of circumstances. Yeah, but they can't blame you. <laughs> They can and do. Over and over, I need to find out what that meant and what else she saw when she was with the variant. Look, I know there's protocol, but she could have information. She's I... dead, Mobius. Oh. The variant. She enchanted C20. It scrambled her mind. The decline looks deeper after. I, I feel like those are lies and deceit. 
Can I trust you to keep that between us? Of course, yeah. Mm. Mm. Don't tell me they're just sitting there chilling. I remember as God. We could have had this in the last episode. Stole a ten pad and I ran for a long, long time. I feel like this would be more catastrophic. Like y'all wouldn't be able to breathe or something if that was actually happening. Any news on T20? No. We need to find them. See what I mean? I'm like, really? If it was coming through the atmosphere, wouldn't they be fiery? I will fight you, bug. Do you think that what makes a Loki a Loki is the fact that we're destined to lose? No. We may lose. Was that outside? Where are you finna boop? Okay, that's not someone stepping on the wrong leaf. You ever seen a branch like that? No. That's going straight up too. Is it because they're they're actively like touching each other? What you finna do? You finna bloop bloop? Wait a minute. How do we get here? So wait, how did I'm confused. How did that them being there cause that to spike when You betrayed me. You betrayed me. You grow up. You grow up. <laughs> All right, it's ready. What is this? You'll see. The TVA is lying to you. He knows it. He already knows it. Seriously? You. You did this. What? Damn. Hi, Sif. <laughs> Hi, Sif. She's so cute. You just gonna let it keep happening? You better stop it. You better block it. You need to trust me. You need to help me escape. What? If there's a mastermind here, I don't think it's Loki. Good. Did Loki say anything while you were in there? Yeah. So the TV is lying to me. Why? Just doing my job. Ma'am, what's going on? Yeah. Shit's not adding up. That tick. Wow. Sir, please, please, no more. He's like, my nuts. My nuts. She's still gonna punch you in your nut sacks. You are alone. And you always will be. Look at that, he changed it. <clears throat> no, what? no, 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 please not. Just wait. wait, wait, wait. He plays too much. Good riddance. But I can't make this face anymore. <laughs> You're, it's like, look at your eyes. You like her. <laughs> you like her. Does she like you? Was she prune? Prune. Prune. How do you spell that? Is that with an I E or just an I? Is she alive? Her name. Bruh, this is bananas. So that's the Nexus event? Praying the TVA was that always sort of the grand plan? Nah, bruh. Just be truthful. Like, no. They're alive. Overthrowing the timekeeper. Maybe they need to be overthrown. The timekeepers didn't create you. They kidnapped you from the timeline and erased your memory. 
memories she can access through enchantment. That's all you had to say in the first place. He believes it. So now he's going to start investigating. Look at her. Look at her. What do you remember? Come with me. Wouldn't you let me? I'm a questioner. I told you we couldn't risk her escaping again. She wouldn't have escaped. The other variant got away during the first interrogation, didn't he? I mean. Mobius, what is going on with you? Nothing. We did it. I know. The timekeepers are happy. Yes, Mission accomplished. That's great. I saw her. I mean, a little freak, but fine. Well, she quickly wasn't fine. Okay. I mean. I just couldn't deal with that happening again. Or anyone else. Y'all, I'm squinting. Friends against time. Allies to the end. What is going on? Thank you. I knew I was your favorite animal. Is that so hard to admit? <laughs> what are you going to do with that trophy? Fair enough. Let's finish this. Nothing. All right. Mm. Listen. Shit's not right. Shit is never right. From all of you. Your variants. We're the same. Show me. I want to see. Let me see. Can I please see? Is that why she was just saying it's all real? What now? You're not hearing me. I was there. This was real what I saw. This is a place that I've been. I had a whole life on the sacred timeline. Calm down, I'm a variant. Right? What are you doing? Passing the time. You care about this variant? Sylvie, I'm not sure if care is the right Shut word. Up. I think we've covered this back Shut in. Shut up! There. Loki! You told me to shut up. Do you really believe you deserve <laughs> to be alone? I don't know. Then you better figure it out quick. So we better understand. We? Bruh! Do you swear she didn't implant those memories in Hunter C20? Mobius, no. I believe her. So I just have to trust that we're the two Lokis? How about the word of a friend? Bruh, listen, I love you. It's real sketchy out here in these streets. About the TVA, you were right from the beginning. And if you want to save her, you need to trust her. So now the four of them are going to be working together. Trouble. What's the problem, Mona? You know where I go if I could go anywhere? it is I'm really from and wherever I had a life before the TVA came along that's what I'd like to do just riding around on my jet ski prune him you just stood there and let it happen my guy what the fuck you just stood there and let it happen I'm not sit I'm not standing to be pruned eat a dick his feelings is really hurt who was in here with her? Sorry, man. B-15 insisted. Them shoes and pants combination be cracking me the fuck up. Where do they put them? If they're not pruning them, where do they put them? This is where they wanted to go in the first place. What the fuck is going on? Is she... I'm... Mm. What was my Nexus event? Must have been important. So what was it? 
I don't remember. She did that shit on purpose. She was like, bitch, I know you want to know. Mm, I don't remember. He's a fishy fish. I think you're scared. For all time. Always. I, I wonder, do they still not have powers? I would, I would suggest, I mean, they're in a TVA. Are you, are you gonna, okay, wait, can they push them off the side? Is there a side to this? No, wait, I'm confused. Oh. Oh, you out here murdering folks. My bad. You're in charge of the timekeepers too, so we can talk. Oh yeah? Y'all just sat there and let y'all friend get Is this some Loki shit? Is this some Loki shit? Then who created the TVA? I thought this was it. Where the fuck are you guys at? I'm looking around. I'm being nosy at this point. You two are a child of the timekeepers? We will figure this out. How do you know? Ho, oh, what? Do it. No. You're gonna tell me everything. This music, they be slapping with this music. Oh my god, I'm trying to figure this out. Are they all related? Listen, I'm thinking that the timekeepers I feel like this is a Loki thing. I feel like this is some Loki bullshit. This is some Loki ass bullshit. It's what they said, you are a child of the timekeeper. I really am trying to I'm like Is the controlling of the timeline just so that this one thing could happen? Like, I'm, ooh, I'm trying to figure this out. I'm hoping there's something at the end. I'm hoping. I knew it! I knew it! Isn't that your sister? Am I dead? Bro, what? Bitch, what? But you will be unless you come with us. Them's a bunch of fucking Lokis. Hold on. And it was a chocolate one. Let's talk about it, sis. Wait a minute. Oh my gosh, y'all, what? What the fuck? Listen, okay, listen. So was it, I have so many questions 
And I don't think any of them are going to be answered. So the TVA is not real. Then how are they able to set up this whole entire system? Who set up the system? I'm thinking it's like a Loki situation who set up the system because he was playing and shit. And he was like, the best way to gather all of me in one place is to go through the timeline and get all the Lokis in one place so that we can merge together to become the, the Loki that we were meant to be, the real serious ass, all encompassing Loki. That's where I'm thinking they're going with this. Um, because, and I'm also wondering, does, uh, what's her name, Ravenna? I think that's her name. Does she know that when she prunes a particular person, do they go to a place like that, but with more of them? You know what I mean? Instead of being like pruned out of existence, you're not pruned out of existence. You're taken from the timeline that you're currently in at the TVA or wherever, and you're put someplace in a segregated separate timeline with everyone, with all versions of you. Does that make sense? Boy, I feel like this is why time travel is so difficult to theorize. <laughs> I'm like, but because the Nexus event was the two Lokis being together. At first I thought maybe they were like father and daughter, but I'm just like, that's kind of, I don't know. It's kind of weird. First of all, she had black hair as a child and then she has blonde hair. Ma'am, did you dye your hair? Like what happened? Where'd you get your dye from? But if everybody is a variant, I'm so, it's so, I'm so confused. I want to figure this out. I want to figure this out, but I, I, with the information given, I don't think I can. So when they pruned Mobius, He's not actually like gone or dead. Man, I have so many questions. I have so many questions. Get out of my, get out of my way. I'm watching the end credit scene again. Give me a second. I just, I'm so confused. I want to be able to figure this out. but you will be. <coughs> I'm trying to look in the background to see where they are. This has got to be like a destroyed version. Is that the Avengers Tower? It looks like an A. I really want to figure this out. I really want to figure this out. So this episode like filled in a lot of the gaps. I think the beginning part with the, with Sylvie as a little girl, that should have been in the last episode because that would have given some weight to what they were doing or what they were discussing. Um, but because the two of them together created a Nexus event, it's like they can always be found, but what the fuck? Who created the TVA? I still think it's some Loki bullshit. I still think it is. Ah. But this episode, I enjoyed a, a lot more because information was given and we were moving. Like the plot was moving forward and I appreciate that so much. I just wish that there were more information. 
um, in the last episode, like the first maybe five minutes, this could have been uh, like an end scene, end credit scene or something for the last episode. But I just want to know where did Mobius go? Where did Mobius go? Where did C20 go? And what's going to happen to, um, is it, is she B15? she B-15? I think that's what she is. I think she's B-15. Um, what's going to happen to her? And what's Sylvie going to do? Because if they prune Sylvie, will she go to the same place that Loki went? And I wonder, can Loki get out of where he is? I mean, it, there were four Lokis in that shot. There was a lizard Loki, a little boy Loki. He looked like a, a very Vikings Loki and an old man comic book Loki. I swear behind them on the right side of the screen, it looked like an A from the Avengers sign. I wonder where they are. So many questions. Y'all, so many questions. I got to get ready to go to work. And my man, I, my mind is going to be spinning and thinking about this until next week's episode. And I'm sad that there are only two episodes left. Damn. I want to figure this out so I can feel great about myself. <laughs> Oh my gosh. But on that note, guys, thanks for hanging with me and hopefully I will catch you in the next one. Bye. Ciao. I'm, I'm, I'm serious about thinking about this all day. I'm serious.